What's going on, everybody? So let's take a quick intraday look at Ride Lordstown Motors. Um, today is August 26th. It is currently 10 a.m. in the morning Pacific Standard Time. I'm located in California. Uh, before we get started with the video, please, if you could do me a favor, subscribe to my channel. Give me a like on this video. Also, when I'm done, drop a comment down below. I want to know what you guys think about Ride. Um, but a little bit of an intraday look here. Nice little gap up on ride. Currently, we're up 90 cents, 16%, and the current stock price is six dollars and forty cents. So, one of the few things that one of the you know, couple of things that I want to look at here with ride is even though I like this gap up here, what I do not like is this big long uh tail here. We did get rejected right here at this red line. This red line on my chart is the 50 day moving average, and I do have the daily chart pulled up here so. On this gap and go, we got stuffed right at the 50-day moving average. For me, the, the big macro trade starts below or above the 50-day moving average. So even though we have you know, a hell of a move on ride today, considering what the stock has been doing, I do not like that we were rejected at the 50-day moving average. Generally speaking, I like to see us get over the 50-day moving average. That current price is around, you know, $7.80. Above $7.80, we do have room to $8.91. I think this is going to be a perfect area of opportunity for a trade here. If we do just go to the hourly time frame, you can see uh, these massive green candles here. We are overextended, though, away from uh, all of the moving averages. So, what I like to see here is a pullback maybe to 630 or even 612. I think if we can get a pullback to those two areas, this would be a good opportunity to buy using those as our stop loss as well. So any close below on a daily just under that, you know, I would just exit the trade. If we kind of come down here and test the $6.34, or even come down here to the 20 day moving average and test is six dollars six dollars and ten cents and we get a nice little pop off of those levels i would consider buying here uh, obviously i'm talking from a, a short-term swing traders perspective as well as a scalpers perspective and a day traders perspective if you are an investor uh, and you're looking to hold this stock six months a year two years five years 20 years uh, this video is probably not going to be for you more show more so on the short term side of things is what I'm talking about. Those are the levels. Obviously, I'll draw I'll draw a little trend line here. Our high of seven dollars and eighty cents. Obviously, a break to the top side. We're going to see more potential room to run here. But as we are coming off of one, two, three, four red candles in a row since the open here at six a.m., um, you know I'd like to see where this kind of bases out at great move in the pre-market and then that first 30 minutes of the market open nice little pop here but we are having a bit of a pullback here so i want to kind of see where this lands uh, before jumping in so you know if, if you're looking to trade this stock or get into this trade i wouldn't get too much fomo um just due to the fact that you don't want to get stuck in the middle of the move right now we are at about a 50 percent pullback on the initial move, which is good. So that would correlate with the 10 day moving average and the linear regression line here. So I'd be looking for a bounce anywhere from that $6 range to that $6 and 30 cent range. If you can scoop and score some uh, stock there, uh, that would be probably one of the best areas. And then you can just use that as a quick stop loss Obviously, the six dollars and 12 cents is our next area here. I wouldn't like to see it drop any 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 lower than six dollars that we we need to hold the six dollar range so we can continue this move to the upside but if you guys did like this video please drop me a comment like subscribe i also have a discord that link is down in the description box below and i will see you guys all on the next video